Welcome back, everyone, to Hogwarts Legacy. We're now on, now on, episode five. Now, what I want to do is I want to actually change my gear before we do anything. So, what I want to do... Take that off, I think. Okay, cool. Alright, let's get started with today's mission. So we're going to go see Nessie. Hi, Nessie. Ah, I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favourite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Uh oh, what's going on? That's a troll. Troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, of course. officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Nice. All right, so... Um, okay, repair the damage. Repairer! Oh, a moment if you want. I was lucky they didn't do more damage. Okay, 
now that's all done. Um, Revelio. Cool. I saw that. Okay. We were just talking about you. Okay. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. Right. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Oh, nice. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Okay. Um... Cool. Okay. Nice. Okay, I don't have any money for that at the moment. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butterbeer. Shall we head to the Three Broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way, then. All right. I sell even more battle-worthy items, should you be inclined. Yes. You're most welcome to... Oh, it's gone foggy. Okay, where are you, Natty? There you are. Hey, cat. Hang on. Hello. Yes, hello. You're a unique specimen, aren't you? Okay. Okay, let's go to the three broomsticks. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Good one to know. Okay, what's going on down there? You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Vanrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. 
I will say, <laughs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... Oh. Our timeline. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the ovenous. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butter beer forever. <sighs> Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Hmm. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. Right. I think that now might be a good time to head back to the castle. Yes. I am certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. All right. Um, cool. So we can use the flu, flu, flu flames to get there quickly. All right, back in Hogwarts. Hogwarts, sorry. Okay. Okay, up to the common room. Slow coach! Slow coach! Oh, Peeves, shut up. Idiot. Oh, okay. Come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found at Gringotts. Okay. Okay, go to speak to Professor Fig. Actually, before we do that, I'm going to take this cloak off. Hey everyone. I just woke up. She's me. Ah. Smuggle him! Spiders into school! I jolly well hope it was. Okay. Are you all playing a song and having a dance? Oh, nice. Okay. Okay, what's that? Lumos. Leviosa, Reparo, Accio, Revelio. Nice. Another field guide. Okay. Whee! Whee!
we, peeves. Oh, Here I've come from the toilet bowl where she said I could swim. Did you practice your mole? What the fuck? Peeves is a weird one. Okay, I need to go this way. Hello. All right. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow, like the dragon collar. Goblin silver! Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade? With Rookwood? The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have, had Serona and the patrons at the Three Brumsticks not intervened. This is great news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Hmm. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit, before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. All right. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. All right. Thanks, Professor. Okay. Hmm, what's this room? Oh, nice to see you, oh, my young friend. Oh, nice to meet you too. Now, um... Was there anything... I can't only go this way. Hmm, and down. Oh, no, excuse me, ow. Might some kind soul help me? I will later. Oh no, I've gone the wrong way. Oh god, damn it! student would help me with my. Okay. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Uh, Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell, handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, 
Come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. Thank you, Professor. You know where to find me once you've finished. All right. Seems crossed wands isn't as secret as it's believed to be. Might some kind soul help me? Yeah, later. I'm in the middle of a mission. I will come back. Make it. Lucan's just over there. Okay. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does cross wands work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelists once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Crossed Ones, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! All right. We'll make you regret signing up. Really? Hello. Let me go for the one. Let me Lumos. Repair it. Let me go Let me go Repair it. Let me go and Bringo. What to do? Nice. <gasps> nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. In fact, the second duel is ready when you are. And as a fully initiated member, you now have access to the official Crossed Ones training dummy. Very good way to master spell combinations. Come and see me, and I'll set it up. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Thank you. Hope to see you back here again. Okay. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? Actually, I might come back later. Suit yourself. I'll be around when you're ready. Okay. Okay. Glad you're back. Let me also. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of crossed ones all set? Why, yes, it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? I'll be dueling solo. Then let's get to it. Ready to get thrashed? Apologies in advance. Ha ha. You're going to die. Let me open. Lumos. Come on, let me open. 
I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you, but after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning, or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. All right. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Accio. Repairer. Complete a round of spell combination practice with Luca. Hello, Lucan. I'm ready for practice. Glad you're keeping at it. Ready to have a try now? Yes, I am. That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Okay. Let me open. Next time, perhaps. Accio. Nicely done. Levioso. Prepare. Accio. Lumos. Potato. You'll get it. Levioso, Akio. That was something. Good one. Levioso. Keep trying. Levioso. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. All right. Cool. Assignment's all finished. All right, now it's time to go back to the professor. Oh, no, wrong way.
Come now, Annabelle. It was a long time ago. student would to help me with my sad predicament. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to... I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would okay. rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Even Let us I'm... begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Okay. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. Got it. And I want tea. Targets at you. Incendio. Getting it. Keep at it. And keep trying to insert yourself. Alright, so ladies and gentlemen, that concludes this episode of Hogwarts Legacy, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheerio!